Good morning. It's 8.30 a.m. on January 9th, 2014. We're in the stairwell of our apartment now. Here's Juliana, bundled up to go out. Sorry about the shaky camera handling, but I want to take you to school with me and show you around. We're on our way to school. Yeah. The temperature is well below freezing. We've given up on keeping a track of the exact numbers. It's cold this morning. It's just cold. And smoggy. Through the night, people have been burning coal to stay warm out in the air. What are you doing, Oma? <laughs> but there are many other kinds of buildings here in Mongolia's capital city besides gears. The kids and I are at the bus stop. Andrew is petting a stray dog. We often save scraps for the starving mama dog since there are so many. The bus stop is about a quarter of a mile from our apartment. Yeah, let's get on. Come on. Electric buses are cheaper, but when it's cold and we don't want to wait, we just ride a regular bus, like this one, which costs about one dollar total for all of us. <laughs> The ride is less than five minutes. We get off and walk some more. Yeah, I'm ready to, um, like, um, a We're stopping by a small store to buy some juice. Mongolia does not use coins, only bills, so I get a lot of change. Okay, let's go. Yeah. Oh, thank you. In the winter, this store keeps a heavy blanket in front of the door to keep the heat in. I thought there's a dog there. Some more walking. Almost there. We try not to slip on the frozen stuff. For some reason, this sidewalk has a lot of it. We took the bus, but Jay had walked, so he catches up with us just as we get to MIU. He's so fast, I had to put this video in slow motion. This is the main building of Mongolia International University. There are two other buildings behind this one. Juliana seems anxious to get inside. But Jay poses for a quick picture in front of MIU. Officially it's break time and school will not start until February 17th. But Appa, or Jay, is teaching an intensive course about world history and we are joining in. So, uh, you can take that A1. Brian is particularly interested in ancient cultures, especially ancient Greece. He wants to be an engineer like Archimedes. And like Jay. Jay is an industrial engineer and a former NASA employee. Not really the history teaching type you'd expect, but God sent us to Mongolia to share the gospel and teach anything that was needed. English, math, physics, computer, and even gym class. Teaching history gets the students thinking about topics such as geography, religion, and leadership, and the consequences of them all. For some of the students, it is the first time they have learned about history other than Genghis Khan's achievements. These students are Mongolia's future leaders. As they hear about how and why nations fall and rise, they consider how their choices can influence their country. Teaching also lets us meet more students in order to share our faith in Jesus Christ outside the class. So, if you have a desire to share the gospel and expand young minds to understand our world, I invite you to come to school with us. For more information, visit our blog at jroxlee.wordpress.com. Thank you for taking five minutes to watch this video. Ask the Lord of the Harvest to send out more workers into his fields. God bless you.